Fallout 4 doesn't even compare. It's it's again like what they do with all games now is that they they are supposed to be easily accessible for eight year olds, and it makes it makes them just boring. Like, who else in the whole world would get stuck with a horse except me? Only I. Only I could get stuck. Can, can somebody run me? Hey, uh, Simos, uh, run me over with the with the tank. I'm stuck with the horse. Can, can you can you push me? We have taken objective butter. Good job, oh, hey. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hi guys, this is Matty Ace, and as you can tell, I am the master of the cavalry class, a complete ace on the horseback. Something that, of course, I have already proven with that first clip. I mean, seriously, who else would actually get stuck with a horse? Now, the cavalry class has uh, gone through a couple of changes. One of the recent changes, which isn't all that recent anymore, is that it has been buffed while you are on the horseback. Uh, it used to be rather powerful even when you were off the horseback, something that to me made it seem almost like an elite class. Now the big change, if there were many I'm not entirely sure, but one of the biggest changes was that now you will be able to heal and resupply yourself even while riding at full speed with your horse, and that makes this class really, really strong. It seems to me also that nowadays this class can take a 180 shot without dying. Maybe I've been missing a few shots, but so far that seems to be the case. Now this rifle, this 1895 cavalry, as it's called, has also been buffed at the range. And I've seen that more and more people have started to get really nice kill streaks while staying on the horse back. So far, my success with the horse has been a bit mixed. Maybe I just simply don't mix all that well with animals, in all honesty. I don't really know what it is, but from time to time I get a few kills and uh, I have enough material at least for a video. Now me, I normally take advantage of the horse more when I play any other class, just uh, jumping up on the horse back if it's been abandoned by the actual cavalryman. One of the major benefits of it is of course your possibility or your ability to heal and resupply yourself, but also the access you have to the two light anti-tank grenades, something that will deal a significant amount of damage to uh, tanks. And uh, for the most part, since I play Assault, I normally approach the tank using the two light anti-tank grenades, then jump off the horseback and use the other gadgets afterwards. And I've had quite a bit of success doing that, something that I also recommend for you to try if you haven't already. Don't get stuck! <laughs> when the tanks were bugged, or when there was... When there was a... Uh, how's, it, how's it called? Oh shit! Ha <laughs> ha. 
So yeah, if you want to counter the horse the way I used to do with the AT rocket gun, make sure that you pull up that SMG right Just after that shot. Damage. So yeah, there are plenty of people that are much better than me as a cavalryman, no, but uh, I hope you will still enjoy this video. My name is Matthias, and I want to thank you all for watching. Explosive skills. Line the wind. Watch it. Return to the combat area. Where do you think you're going? We need it. Collecting my health. <laughs> this class is pretty damn good. So damn strong. This <laughs> 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 Shit! Ran out of ammo! Holy moly! Shit, I, the grenade took longer to explode than I thought. Wait, maybe I can get you. All right. Horse, horse fight. Instead of a dog fight.
<laughs> Should be, right? Oh, I killed him by accident with my light anti-tank grenade, I think. 